Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can fix Valorant stock at 30% while downloading or updating in 2023. This is a complete tutorial that I have for you. I'm gonna show you step by step um, and a lot of really important steps. Please try all the steps in this in the, that, I'm the, that I'm gonna show you in this video and please leave your results in the comments section, all right? I'm really curious to see if this worked, so make sure you try all the steps and leave your results in the comments section all right because i'm really curious to see if this works for you and please follow along with me and now let's jump right in the video without wasting any second so guys what you have to do first and that's the really the most i mean that's the first thing is just restart the game restart the right client or just restart a download and then check your internet connection it's right here internet speed test and here you can check by all these websites, there are tons of these websites that can uh, help you, you know, see what's your current internet speed. And if it's low, then that's the reason. You can also change from here, from your cable connection to your Wi-Fi connection or to your from your Wi-Fi connection that is maybe slow to your cable connection, all right? So make sure you change that, vice versa, see which one works better. And maybe during your your downloading speed or your updating speed will increase this is what happened to me started really working way faster way faster and yeah now let's jump to the step number two okay and here what we have to do is just make sure if you click on taskbar manager here make sure if you click on network there's no apps there's running in the background and just stealing or or like just taking your internet connection from you maybe there's an app there's downloading maybe it's brave maybe it's a browser chrome that is just updating so make sure that you don't have any apps here there's running in the background consuming your data and um, you also maybe have discord all right so make sure you click on end task and yeah that's pretty much it now let's jump to the next method and here what you have to do is to click on here on open network and uh, open network internet settings and then click on advanced network settings and then go to more advanced network adapter options all right and here what you have to do is to click on your network this is for me click on options and then here go to internet protocol version 4 and click on properties and here please check use the following DNS servers addresses okay instead of probably this is for you checked obtain the addresses automatically make sure you make sure you use the following DNS server addresses and here type 8888844 all right so that's what you have to do and now the next method I'm going to show you in this video is pretty important and what you have to do here is to we have to allow right client client to you know access our internet pretty much so what you have to do if you head over to this in the search bar make sure you type allow an app through through windows firewall okay and click on the first option here oh allow an app through app through windows firewall okay click on the first option and here what you have to do is click on change settings and then here click on allow another app click on browse click on here we have right client click on right client and open add it's already in the list for me already added here so I don't have any problem with the internet and everything should work just fine here riot let's look for riot should be here okay look here click make sure you check both of these boxes and then you click on ok now let's move to the next um, next uh, method what you have to do here is to head over to command prompt and here run command prompt as an mini shader you should see there are options to run as a mini shader and then there what you have to do is just to enter this command where is it okay here copy this command ip config slash flush dns enter paste and successfully flush in your server so this will really help you because guys your computer will store uh, 
will just store a lot of your data and that's what you have to do sometimes some dns will are they're corrupted so for for a reason and this can um, lead to internet problems so make sure you clean your dns and then by cleaning dns flushing it your ips this will ensure that you don't have any problem with your internet connection and now the next thing you also can head over to device manager and here update our update our network and adapters okay click on update search and make sure you have the latest update you can also go to windows update and start the latest update or you can go to advanced options here and then here in optional updates and then here you should see a lot of updates available to you i don't have any available drive available updates at, at this time but when i check this it was around 20 updates drivers listed for me to download and install so yeah make sure you check that and this is pretty much what you have to do now there is another method that i forgot to mention here which is you can also go to task manager click on task manager task manager from here and then go to right client now i don't have right client open but i'll open right client right now and now we have right client make sure you click right click on right client make sure you click on right client and then you go to go to details and here you see right client services right click select set priority and make sure you set to high this will ensure that is you know like your internet the right client will have the the like priority okay so this will ensure windows will give priority more importance to right client and then this will fix the problem so don't won't have any problems so make sure you try this method as well this is very important and can really fix your problem this can really fix this annoying problem because you can't really play the game if we have this problem all right so i hope guys this video helped you make sure you subscribe for more tutorials i really appreciate it and i'll see you now in the next video take care and i hope you're gonna have a fantastic day take care